What's up guys? Welcome back to part 14 of our playthrough of Star Fox 64 on the N64. This is the retro experiment and we are going to play the level Katina in this part. Now, for those of you that watched the video before this, part 13, you probably heard a difference in my voice. It's because I forgot to turn my mic on, so it was picking up my laptop's microphone. So, sorry about that. Um, still don't quite understand how the settings consistently change on their own on this. But, with all that said, today we're playing Katina. Now, if you guys look at this map here at the bottom of the screen, you can see the planet Corneria where we had 99 enemies down, and you see a blue line connecting that to Mateo where, where we have 182 enemies down. Now, if you remember from parts 1 through 6, the blue lines mean the easy route, right? Now, if you see from Mateo going over to Katina at the bottom of the map, there's a yellow line connecting those two. Um, on the actual map, you've got the little yellow star that's warping us over there, but I'm talking about the little pictures of the planets at the very bottom of the screen, the seven that connect us all the way to Venom. So you see the yellow, yellow line. Uh, the yellow line signifies the medium route, the medium route difficulty, okay? So blue's easy, yellow's medium, red is hard. And you saw the hard route um, all the way through, what, what do I wanna say, parts seven through 12? But what we're gonna do here is there are, we got Katina that we're going to next, then the big red planet in the center, and then the blue one or gray one right in, above that one. Um, we'll play through this medium route in the next few parts. Uh, and then we'll come back to a few levels that have multiple parts, but we'll get to that as that goes on. For now, we're going to play Katina, and we'll stay on this medium route. What we got to do on this level is you'll see what the boss is once we get to it, but we've got to destroy it before the timer runs out, and that's how we're going to get to stay on the medium route and get right to that giant red planet in the center. So, you guys know the line? Stop talking about it and let's do it. Katina is battling the enemy. Will you help him out? Affirmative, General. Like I said before, this is my favorite uh, level. For those of you watching that have played this game before, leave in the comments on what's your guys' favorite level. I'd like to hear that. I remember as a kid playing this all the time just because there's so many enemies and you can just play this you know obviously for as long as you can take I remember the first time I played this I was shooting down all the good guys ships because I thought oh yeah everything besides my people are the the bad guys now until they finally said stop shooting our enemy our partners down here we go Gotcha. There's one down. I wish they could have picked that feature up too where your partners could get Oh, I just shot down one of them. Sorry. I wish they could your partners like Slippy, Falco, and Peppy could get laser boost too. I won't let you get away from me. Oh, and hopefully I remember I forgot to mention what the um, I should probably get that. What the uh, oh, what the metal requirements are. There's the mothership right here. I won't let you get away from me. Scratch one boat. Bulldog unit. Don't let anything through. See here. So here we go. So this mothership will hover over that pyramid structure. And you'll see what it does first. See these wings will open up with these bottom panels. Way more enemies come out. So what you can do is when those panels open up, and they'll let you know when they open up, you start 
um, you go through and shoot them down, try and destroy them. That will minimize how many enemies are on the field at once that are getting in your way. Now, you still should be able to beat this level without worrying about the enemies themselves. It's not like they really go out of their way to destroy you, or at least I feel like they don't. Um, But just wait for Bill to tell you when they open up again. And, oh, I just shut down one of ours. Sorry, guys. Hey, what's the big idea? I got one. The hatches are open. Hey, what's the big idea? Hey, see if I help you again. Up to you. Cover the base. Time for a little payback. And this level's very similar if you guys remember the part watching in Fortuna where we had to let Star Wolf, the first time we met Star Wolf, we had to let them win. You guys are, oh, they're open. Oh, I missed it. If you guys remember, we had to let Star Wolf win. This is very similar to that in that the next time we play this level, this time we're going to beat this mothership and I'm going to show you how to stay on the medium route. But if, if somehow you miss the timer in the mothership, uh, thanks for flying right into it. And the mothership. I won't let you get away from me. Um is able to destroy that structure then it puts you right back on the easy route because it's basically like you failed right and so that would send you right back on the blue path here we go so Bill just let us know hatches are open here we go now watch this See how we can destroy them. And so now that's one less hatch where enemies will be coming out of. I won't let you get away from me. What I used to do as a kid, I'd play this level forever. I wouldn't destroy any of the hatches. I always loved games like um, that had just an open map and it just kept producing uh, enemies and you can just keep doing it over and over again. I don't know why I like the repetition. It was similar, if you guys remember, for PS2, the the um, Lord of the Rings game. You guys remember that? I, I want to say it was Return of the King that had the level, uh, the Southern Gate. And you, I would just stand in that battlefield and just fight over and over and over again. Okay, here we go. So now the timer, you see we got one minute. You'll see what I'm talking about. Here we go. So look at this giant... ...counter that's coming, or... ...point that's coming out of the center of the mothership. You just come through and you destroy that thing. If you get the length of the, the map and just keep hitting it, you'll get it in one trip. But that's how you take out the mothership itself. And while this is uh, going through the outro, I'll look up how many enemies down to get a medal on this level. I want to say it's probably 200. Oh, 150. So we're, we, we could definitely get that. You too, Bill. So I'm assuming Bill is just one of our buddies that we're coming in to save, similar to how Cat was too. And there you go, guys. That's Katina. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me. That's Katina. And you see this yellow route that we're on right to that center red planet now. This is the medium route. So... 
that's uh, we'll come back to Katina in a later video and I'll show you what it looks like if you fail and you can't beat the mothership but it's pretty straightforward you should be able to um, that's it for part 14 uh, we will this next level is called solar and so you'll see that one that one's basically a giant lava planet um, but we'll get to that in part 15 as for part 14, we're all done here. You guys like and subscribe if you like the content. And I'll see all you guys at the next part. See ya.